comment below, let me know what are your thoughts on social media, how are you applying it to your personal life, your business world, or maybe you're combining both and you're really documenting that whole process. Why is social media marketing so important for business? What if I don't like social media? I think it goes into two angles, right? Your personal, how you feel about the social media side, do you want to share to your audience? or do you want to focus on that business side? Like for example, let's say personally for me, I share a lot about my business world, my business life, and it really translates really into my personal life as well. I don't really share about my personal details to a certain degree. I share with you guys my story. And for me, I'm actually a very private introverted person, believe it or not. So for me to actually speak to you guys on the camera, add value to you, it took some time to get used to, but I think from a business perspective, it's a great investment. So if you're doing this right now, you can create videos content wise for your target audience. You have to do it. I think really adding value through content now is easier than ever before. And it's more simpler as well. And people are paying attention to you. That's how you cut through the noise. For me, it's a personal brand. It's easier for me to record a video. If you're focusing on, let's say a business corporate brand, then you want to have your team or someone create that content that's entertaining, engaging, and making sure that the video content you produce matches with the values of your target audience. That's really, really key what I just said. Make sure your content, your tone of voice, your personality, everything that you put out, the whole branding of your content or your business when you're putting it on social media, it all is, um, it all flows together, it all combines, and at the same time, it's all resonating with your target audience as well. So the second thing is that the importance of why digital marketing, I mean, social media is so important is because that's where your target audience is. If your target audience has a phone right now and you're getting them to, to buy from your business, you need to be on social media. You need to be on the platforms that are relevant to them, the ones that are paying attention, right? The reason why social media, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, whatever social platform you name, why they're so popular and why they're the mega kings of everything is because, and they control the attention of the target audience or the social focus is because your target audience is on there, they're spending time, they're learning from their friends, they're, they're connecting with their friends, their family. It's the way that people connect on social platforms. Connection is the key word on these platforms and why you need to be on there because if you want to connect with your target audience, it's extremely important. The goal is how do you be able to create effective social media without actually spending a ton of time or money doing it, right? That's really the biggest thing. You know, I have a lot of business tell me social media, like you're asking the most important thing. Where does it fall into the business building process? Is it a priority right now? Is it a priority later? Where does it actually fit in with the whole business growth aspect? I think it's important uh, to a certain degree when you want to take it to the next level, uh, if you're not a personal brand. I think you shouldn't build a business on social media. I think that you should focus on just building a real business first. You can leverage social media as a specific channel and you can run advertising as a completely different story, but if you want to build organic social media traffic, that takes time. It's the same thing as SEO on Google. You know, it takes months to years before you actually see an actual following um, on social media. Again, uh, if your e-commerce is different too. If your e-commerce, you should focus on that. You can do influencer marketing, generate sales. It really depends on the business that you're in and also the audience that you're going for, the resources that you have, the priority, what stage of your business are you at? Are you just starting out? Are you at a million dollars right now? Are you at $10 million? Are you at 100 million? The bigger your business is and the more relevant your target audience is to the social media platform, then sure, the more you want to focus on that. The most effective way on social media is to produce relevant content that resonates with your target audience and it adds value to them at each touch point. Every time someone engages with your social media, you want them to get value from it. Some kind of piece of value, the value that means the difference to your target audience. That's the most important thing. So thanks for watching this video. If you got value from this or an insight, I want you to comment below and let me know. That's the most important thing I wanna hear from you. Comment below and let me know how, what you think social media is the most effective for your business. How would you implement social media right now? Or any insights or questions that you have, and also like this video, and make sure you subscribe to the channel, and also hit that bell icon there. It's the most important thing. You guys will get notifications for any time videos are released to add value to your business, and also be able to start this conversation with you. And, uh, go even further and build this community. So thank you for thanks for watching this and I appreciate you guys' time and attention as usual.